Are you on off camera? I'm still gonna think. I'm still gonna consider. Maybe I'll just take and there was a dent there. I'm gonna just sand it now. Inside there. It's gonna be cool like I'm some welding and repairs there, so Hey guys welcome back to the channel and to another video yeah it's been a while since i had anything of the mini out there in this video i'll be doing some body work on the on the mini we are almost there it's almost complete so yeah enjoy guys okay so i'll start on this fender and the first thing that i'm seeing i don't know if you can see it there i'm trying to let it Trying to highlight it in the light. You can see there's like bubbles here. Can't really feel it, but there are there are bubbles here. So I'm gonna take a grinder and grind on these bubbles to see what's underneath it and I'll probably just body fill that up. So that got rid of all those those bubbles. Might be one over there. Might be one over here that I missed. But basically that got rid of all the bubbles. So as I was grinding, I did see like a little rust on this, you know, underneath here, which I just grinded away. So that looks good. I'll start flattening this area. I'm just going to grind this bubble away here. And then I'll start roughening up this area, mixing up some body filler and getting it in there. Okay, so I'm going to carry on off camera. I'm going to be flattening, I'm going to be mixing, but I'll show you different stages as I go along. I won't be recording everything. And then, yeah, let's see what happens. I thought I'll just chuck this in quickly, put some body fill on here. So I'll be flattening that down. Adding on where I should. And then I'll carry on. So I basically want to finish this panel first. You know, all the body work that's to be done on that panel. As I said previously. And I'll move to the door and then further on down. Okay, so I've been flattening it down with this boy key. And it felt nice and smooth. So what I generally do after flattening it, I mean after sandpapering it with with this, I generally take a wire brush and I wire brush over it. I wire brush over it because what feels smooth, the low spot could be filled up with with you know these this dust. So you actually feel the smooth surface. I generally take a wire brush, wire brush it out, and then you can actually see like there, 
the you know there's a few spots where the wire brush actually brushed out the dust so then I know okay there I must put some more body filler because like I said once you start sandpapering it the dust fills up fills up the low spots and then when you rub your hand over it it feels kind of smooth but then it's not actually so I normally use a wire brush it's kind of just something that I do other people might have different techniques but that's kind of what I do and it kind of works for me because like I said because you end up just wire brushing the dust out and then you can see where the flat spots are so I'm going to carry on now I'm going to sandpaper that then I'll mix up another little and put it on the low spots and um, yeah Alright guys, so I done all the body putty on this side and I sanded it all down. This is how it came out. There's just a bit of a high spot there, there that I'll I'll tackle with the final the final go around. So that's how that came out. I went over the door here. There's a couple of dents on the door here. I can see some high spots here. I'm still gonna think. I'm still going to consider, maybe I'll just take, and there was a dent there. There was a dent there. But here was a couple of dents that one couldn't really see. So, I ran it with one of those broad, those broad um, sandpaper pads. And it lifted that up. So, I'm going to leave this side like this for now and um, start on that side. Okay guys, so as you can see, I kind of done most of the grinding, all the grinding basically, where I must put the, the body filler, this whole area here I'll have to put the layer of body filler and then work it down, this is where the impact was, here on the door as well. It's a little bit higher, so I'll have to knock that in or shrink the metal, whichever it takes. But I'll have to do that. Do this. At the bottom there. It was a little bit of a dent here. Don't know if that was part of the collision. I doubt it actually. But anyway, I grinded that clear there. And then just done all the other little spots here. It was also a little dent here and down here was also a dent so i basically done all the the grinding on the vehicle and i'm going to start putting the body putty here was also a little bit of a dent i, I can actually feel it 
So I'll start doing some body party work now. Yep, I'll just carry on with this off camera and I'll show you when it's completed. Okay, so that's all the, the body putty done on this side. I'm going to just sand it now. Got it all the way down here. Inside there. If you can recall, I've done some welding repairs there, so put some filler there. It's all at the bottom. You know, and then the little odd spots that I discovered that dent that was there. Then that was there. And the one that was on the door there. So this is all fitted up. That one on the roof. And there's some patches all over the bonnet. All fitted up. So I'm going to sand it next. Sand it down. And then I'll show you. I'll give you a, a walk around the vehicle. Alright guys, so I think I've done with all the body work on the Mini right now. I'll take you on a quick walk around um, and then I'll be preparing it for the spray filler or MS primer or whatever you want to call it. After the spray filler, I'll be putting some primer on, grey primer, and then I'll start to put colour on the car. Okay, let's go for a walk around. Right, so this is how this this panel came out here. It didn't come out too bad. I mean, I'm no no panel shop, so it's the best that I could do. Didn't come out too bad. Spray fur will cover up all the little bits. That's the that dent there. Just like that, I'm ending this video here, guys. I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, if you did, give us a thumbs up, give us a like, hit the notification bell, and subscribe. Tell your friends about it. Until the next one. Cheers for now.